First, I'll tell you why you need to discover your unique talents. Steve Harvey, an American comedian and businessman, once said, Your whole life will have new meaning and direction when you realize your gift and decide upon the most valuable way to use it. Talent involves the skills, abilities, and expertise that determine what a person can do. It differs for everyone. Discovering your talents will help you to live life to the fullest. The result of this is that you would have consciously created a life of happiness for yourself and fulfilled your purpose. John Dewey, an American philosopher and psychologist said, To find out what one is fitted to do and to secure an opportunity to do it is the key to happiness. Your talent, in addition to your knowledge and level of hard work, will set you apart from others. Your talent is what differentiates you from the rest of the world. However, it has to be combined with hard work and adequate information. Anyway, now that we know why we should be interested in finding out what our unique talents are, let's see how we can find them out. In this video, I'll share with you 9 questions that will help you discover your unique talents. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you don't miss out on exciting videos like this. 1. What comes to you naturally? There are a few activities that come naturally to us. Most times, these activities lead to efforts or prior knowledge. Most times, when you think of these activities, you feel excited and willing to them. They are things you find very easy and obvious to do, while others have a hard time doing it. I mean, to you, you can't seem to wrap your head around why others find that activity a little bit challenging. So, it's like this. You know how to do it quickly, but others struggle with it while you stand out. 2. What do you lose track of time doing? Have you ever found yourself so caught up in an activity that you lose track of time? For instance, you plan spending just a few minutes to get a job done. The next thing you know, you've spent a couple of hours on it. Perhaps you haven't had something to eat. Does that sound like a familiar event for you? If it does, that activity might just be something that you're incredibly talented in doing. It comes naturally to you that you don't pay attention to many hours you spend doing it as long as you do it. Doing that activity makes you happy. Your mind, body, and intuition begin working in perfect symmetry. You lose track of time and you're not even thinking about food or any other thing that might serve as a distraction. Discovering that activity puts you in a state that might help you find that hidden talent you have been searching for for a long time now. 3. What gives you result every time you do it? What activity gives you result easily every time you try them? For instance, if your talent is sales, you likely hit your goals every month. Or if you're good at innovative thinking, you might share ideas at work that prompt new projects. Find out what activity yields reward every time you try it. So aside from the fact that it comes naturally to you, you lose track of time and you also get rewards or results for doing it. Does that sound like a good pointer? Yes, good for you. Not yet. Well, there's still a couple more questions you can ask yourself. 4. What do you receive the most praise for? When was the last time you got praised or thanked for something? What was it? Now, think back to a couple of times before that as well. What did people praise you for the most? Well, say you haven't taken note of what people praise you for the most. You can ask your family members and friends. When something comes naturally, it doesn't always seem special. So, to get some help, why not ask your loved ones? If you have more than one person pointing out the same thing, it is an indicator of your talent. I mean, the answers provided will help you to narrow down. So use your friend's perspective to work on what you'd like to do better. 5. What would you do if money wasn't a problem? Take your mind off the real-life events happening around you for a moment. It's time to do a little wonderland tour. Think of something you'd love to do or probably be doing now if money wasn't a problem. Do you have something in mind? Yes, that might just be it. It might just be the talent you've been trying so hard to figure out for a long time. Start small and move your way up the ladder. Put your talent to work instead of letting money serve as a hindrance. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day. Great things take time and patience. 6. What do you spend the most money on? Another part of money consideration of discovering your talent is tracking your expenses. What do you spend your money getting most of the time? James W. Frick, an American author, said, Don't tell me where your priorities are. Show me where you spend your money and I'll tell you what they are. Consider checking out your finances in the last six months 
to one year to figure out where you've been spending your money the most. It can serve as a pointer to what you love doing most, which might just be your talent. In most cases, our talents are things we love doing the most because we find it pretty easy, unlike some others who may have to struggle or muddle their way through. For instance, if in the last year you've spent more money attending fitness classes, events, watching videos on the internet, etc., then it might be a sign for you. There are several careers in that field. You only need to observe yourself more carefully to figure out which of them you'd love to do. 7. If you could be or do anything, what will it be? Take a moment to think about this. What will you do or be if nothing could stop you? If there were no obstructions, what will you do? The question taps into your internal desires and can help you identify your purpose. An excellent way to answer this question is to consider those things you like to do in your free time or the projects at work you volunteer for or seek out. 8. What are you most critical about? There are so many issues in the world, but one of them mostly resonates with you. You think of firm, actionable plans that can help deal with this situation. You even take time to research, come up with solutions and strategies on the issue. You are so passionate and vocal about the issue that your friends have even given you a nickname for it. Sometimes, they tell you to take a break from it. Figuring what activity puts you in such a situation can help you discover your talents. 9. What are your strengths? Try taking time to notice when you feel good about yourself and what improves your self-worth. You feel the strongest those times and you are excited about life, ready to take on any challenge. Do you know what? That activity that makes you feel that way is your strength. So, to find out where your strength lies, it will help to figure out the activity that makes you feel good about yourself and create more opportunities to feel that way. Who knows, you just might figure out the exact thing you are doing that is responsible for that feeling. Again, your talent is supposed to make you feel good about yourself and your value. It will point you in the right direction to go and help you achieve your purpose, which is why it is crucial to figure out what makes you unique from the rest of the world. Thank you very much for watching our videos. If you like this video, watch more videos on our channel and subscribe. We love you.